Um, I'm ready. So this morning, we are at the ancient Armenian capital of Ani. And hiking around, looking at the ruins. And one of the first things you notice here is that um, in the past few years, there's been some work, some construction work done here. Uh, the local people call it restoration or renovation. I'm not sure if it qualifies as either of those terms. But some work is being done. Um, I hope it's true to, to, to the uh, integrity, the historical integrity of the, the region, but I don't, I don't know that it is. At first glance, it looks like there are braces that are mostly cosmetic rather than structural. But as far as the history goes, this is sometimes referred to as the city of a thousand churches. Um, a little bit of hyperbole there, it's not a thousand churches, but there were a lot of churches, maybe a hundred. Um, certainly more than there needed to be, probably, for this size of community. Uh, in its heyday, Ani rivaled any of the European capitals for its population, its wealth, and its strategic location. So this is a very significant site for the Armenians. Of course, we haven't had Armenians here for quite some time. I think it's been uh, the last time there was an Armenian in residence here uh, was in the 1800s. And the last time there was a city here, a population, was several hundred years ago. There have been earthquakes here. There have been pillages, sieges. Uh, the history has been glorious, but it's also been tragic. So we're going to take a look around some more. Awesome.